Look, I have that discussed and what have been the wrong with it? I have. No. How do you treat the pretends for long? It is so easy. What? What? No. Definitely not kill my mouth. Unless the patient is unconscious. What, what, what's the first drug you use? Come on. Thank you very much. What is the action of lecturers? Lecturers is a dissector, which is non absorbable. Okay, first he is axis, when small bouncing is non, non absorbable, it acts as a laxity. In fact, one of the first uses of laxatives is as a laxity. And then in large form, what happens? In large form, you metabolize lactic acid by the lactobacilli. Yes, acid, um, you are looking at some of those. Perhaps that ammonia to ammonia. Yes, yeah. okay, you are looking at some of those as no, okay. But you're absolutely correct. Okay, in the large part is decorated by lactic acid line into what? Lactic acid and ammonia. And ammonia would then form NX4 with the guts ammonia and also draw NX3 from the blood to form NX4. And it is another more reaction of lactic acid line. By the acid that Medium. It inhibits the growth of other bacteria other than lactobacilli. So I repeat again, lactulose acts as an osmotic diarrhea reagent and a large part technically in the lactic acid acid medium. So it, and it will inhibit other bacteria and draws NH3 from the gut and from the in these species to form NH4. Any other way you can treat it? Let, let you, um, Hepatitis cirrhopathy. Yes, if the patient can, sometimes actually, um, we try to induce two to three times diarrhea per day in the extraction. If it on its own, it doesn't work, you can add on by vaccinate. What is by vaccinate? Hmm? If it's an antibiotic, it should be not at all. Okay, um, it's quite expensive, so it's you're not usually using the first line agents. Um, Anything else? What about the diet? Normal protein diet, unless it is promoted by high protein, no, unless it is, and some of it is promoted by high protein. This has been confirmed in a study by the <coughs> big dietitians. I think it's been too old for five. They say that normal protein diet um, would not affect the cause of uh, hepatitis neuropathy. In fact, a patient with cirrhosis liver has abnormal protein metabolism. So if you withdraw protein, they will be doing worse. So unless it's provoked by high protein diet, like GRP, yes. And, and then maybe a patient is in, actually I've seen a patient who is in discharge and he went out to, to take a loss of the result. And then this person would be served to be starved. Anything else? So, okay. <clears throat> Lectulose, by fixing it as a second line, and then normal green diet unless the cause of the like uh, of the result is provoked by the high protein diet. Finally, one thing else. Chris? What? Amino um <coughs> Amino S is mainly for the surgeons who want to build up the patient. Okay. <coughs> okay, you are not wrong, okay, but we don't usually give it. What sort of amino acid? Brown chain amino acid, okay. Anything else? E10 solution to decrease the metabolism, the protein metabolism. Give a very sufficient calorie, 10% dextrose. 10% ten, ten, ten percent dextrose script to, de, to decrease the protein metabolism. One final thing is lactose actually can also, if it's not well absorbed, can also act as the same. How many percentage of adult mammals will have lactose intolerance? That includes the um, dolphins, etc. It's true, actually, you try to feed the dolphins, they'll probably have diarrhea.
medical tips to the treatment of hepatic encephalopathy. I have a memory. Large, L-A-R-G-E, L, lactulose, is the first choice for treatment of episodic overt hepatic encephalopathy. A, amino acids. Oral branched chain amino acids can be used as an alternative or additional agent to treat patients non-responsive to conventional therapy. R, rifesamine, is an effective add-on therapy to lactulose for prevention of recurrent hepatic encephalopathy. G. Glucose. Dextrose. In case of deep encephalopathy, oral intake should be withheld and IV dextrose should be provided until improvement. E. Energy. Daily energy intakes should be 35 to 40 kilocal per kg, ideal body weight. Daily protein intake should be 1.2 to 1.5 gram per kg per day. There is consensus that low protein nutrition should be avoided for patients with hepatic encephalopathy. Recommendations for further reading. 10 minutes reading. An article in New England Journal of Medicine. 2016. A more detailed study for more than 16 minutes, you can read Practice Guideline by the American Association for the Study of Liver Diseases and the European Association for the Study of the Liver. 2014. Thank you for joining Professor Lai Chenglong's Medical Teaching Sessions. See you next time.